Hello guys, this is Mumoy Abnoy and you're watching The Labyrinth of Ragnarok and in this episode, we are going to talk about Ifrit Cards. So, Ifrit Cards is um, the most one of the most expensive cards here in The Labyrinth of Ragnarok. Let me show you why here. It uh, can be equipped on the ring type gear and this is the Ifrit card. That's a 5 star card and it can cast two skills aside from its um, magic attack attributes there on the top the second uh, the bottom here is the fire pillar with a fire element the third one at the bottom is the earthquake and that's the earth type element so both of them can cast in any weapon so when I say any weapon, even if it's dagger, bow, uh, a sword, or a wand that you are um, equipped, all right, any job class, this card can effectively cast these two skills, all right. This is the reason why this is so expensive. But let me just go ahead and actually show you what is the real benefit for a high wizard fire type like me. So. Let me just go ahead and go back here. Go back. And let me just go ahead and show you. I have a built-in far pillar that is passive to me. Okay. It's given to me on a third job here as a higher wizard. Alright. As you can see, it's passive. And I have a built-in buff as well for a fire type element. Here. Alright. Fire damage increase. So let's go back. Now, let me just go ahead and do some experiment in here. I'm going to remove my built-in, um, what I mean, my Ifrit card here on my ring. So it's now gone. Alright. Now I'm going to switch maps. Because sometimes it has a bug. So if, uh, if you feel like um, there is um, no changes, alright on your character if you equip or um, unequip something on your um, character just switch map all right to remove the bug so currently right now i am at the coral the west cave number three and it's still casting the power pillar as you can see there all right without the effort cards okay without the effort cards now here's the thing i'm going now to reset my skills in here all right to disable this okay and then after that we're going to equip the ifrit card let's see how much um, uh, is the probability rate of the fire pillar on the ifrit card itself by um, equipping only okay equipping only the ifrit card so i'm going now to reset here my skills confirm now it's completely reset as you can see there's nothing in here anymore all right now i am going now to equip the card here how to equip so now it's still casting the power pillar okay because i equip and then um there power pillar now i'm going to switch a map here because once again sometimes there is a bug while you change something on your character okay it happens sometimes so i'm going now to um for the sake of testing it all right i'm going to switch some maps in here to be able to completely remove any bug okay so currently there is no skills equipped and let's see if it still can cast the earth there we go so earthquake that's what uh, came from the ifrit card the drain life is for the drain layer card, right? So the power bolt, there we go, the power pillar, the recovery support. So Lady Tani, that the record that's the recovery support. Now I'm going now to add the buff here, the buff. There we go. 
And then once again, I am going to um, add the nail palm beep here. This is for the basic attack, for a high whiz, okay, and also for a professor. Here. Now since I add both, the buff, all right, here, that's uh, the one is active. I'm going to switch some map, the map in here to remove any bug or the changes to take effect on my character. There we go. So I am back now on the West Cairo Cave in here. Now once again, the reason why I'm switching maps in between, all right, after I do some, make some changes to apply the changes, okay? Because sometimes there's a bug, all right, on the game itself, right? That's why I'm um, switching map to remove the bug. So there. So as you can see, um, the cast of the earthquake type skills on the effort card is higher. Now the reason why it is higher, let me just go ahead and go back to my ring and then go back to the card. It's because the cast rate, all right, the cast rate here of the earthquake is 36.25. And the cast rate of the fire pillar is only 4.5. That's the cast rate. This is not the damage. This is the probability of the cast. Okay, how much is the probability that you can cast a certain skills? This one. Once again, this is not a damage. This is the cast rate. Okay, that's the probability of that skill, the two skills that you can cast. All right. Now, once again, I am now going to remove... Okay, let me just go ahead first and show you here. Okay. So it can cast, it's okay. It can cast Fire Pillar, the Fire Bolt. The Fire Bolt came from the cast card, okay? There we go, the Fire Pillar again. Now, do notice the Fire Pillar is actually um, uh, still uh, low on the cast rating here. All right? Because I did not add the fire pillar passive that is built in on a high whiz. Okay, just want to let you know, okay? I just want to let you know on this. Now, I'm going now to equip again here the fire pillar, the passive. And you will notice in here, now let's go ahead and, okay, apply. And then this one, this is not the damage. The plus 75 in here is not a damage. That is the cast rate that is built in, okay? That is the passive for level 30 fire pillar on a high whiz. Now the damage is at the bottom, the plus 30 or the fire pillar. Okay. Once again, the top, the plus 75 is the cast rate. So this is much higher than my card. Now let's go back. Now let's go ahead and remove the card, the if it card. Now to apply the changes, you go to a different map here. Sorry guys for the background, I do believe it's raining outside in my house, so please bear with me. <laughs> so there we go guys, so the cast rate on my fire pillar, on my built-in fire pillar, okay, for the high whiz, is 75, so that's why the fire pillar in here is raining like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> so question. Is it still good to buy an effort card if you are a high whiz? Well, the answer is yes, because um, not only you will get the far pillar as additional cast rate, all right? It's because you will have this as well. Let's go ahead and auto equip that, okay? Earthquake, that's the plus 36 here, okay? So you will have additional um, skills okay that's potentially can um, deal or dealt damage okay to the enemy itself all right and also um, the effort card is uh, much more uh, in demand for uh, a professor type okay because um, as you can see here that's the mage type as well all right and it can um, you know do the same thing, casting the power pillar, all right, like me, as a high whiz, all right? So there we go, guys. If you do have any questions regarding on this game, all right, just comment down below, 
all right and also if you do like this video please um click the thumbs up and if you don't like this video it's okay click the thumbs down so that i can go ahead and make a better video next time well again this is mumoy abnoy thank you for watching bye for now